Princess Isabella and the Enchanted Artifacts Once upon a time in the kingdom of Eldoria, a place of magic and wonder, there lived a young princess named Isabella. She had a kind heart and an insatiable curiosity for the mysteries of the world. Eldoria thrived under the harmonious balance of magic, but that balance was shattered when an evil sorcerer named Malachi stole four powerful enchanted artifacts that controlled the balance of magic in the realm. Princess Isabella, known for her unwavering determination, was chosen by a mystical amulet forged by the ancient beings of Eldoria to reclaim the stolen artifacts and restore balance to the kingdom. With her loyal companions, a brave knight named Sir William, and a mischievous yet resourceful sprite named Pixie, Princess Isabella embarked on an extraordinary quest. Their journey took them through treacherous forests, across vast deserts, and over towering mountains. Along the way, they encountered mythical creatures and faced daunting challenges that tested their courage and resilience. Princess Isabella drew strength from the amulet that gave her magical abilities and served as a guiding light. Their first destination was the Forbidden Grove, a place rumored to be inhabited by fearsome beasts. As they entered the darkened forest, the air grew thick with an eerie silence. They moved cautiously forward, their senses on high alert. Suddenly, monstrous vines snaked toward the trio, trying to ensnare them. Princess Isabella, channeling her newfound powers, summoned a gust of wind to repel the vines and free her companions. Deep within the grove, they discovered the ancient Tree of Whispers, a sentient being with knowledge of the stolen artifacts. The tree informed them that the first artifact, the Crystal of Elements, was hidden in the heart of the Fire Mountains. A dangerous region engulfed in eternal flames. Undeterred, Princess Isabella and her companions traversed the scorching terrain, their determination unwavering. The heat was unrelenting, but they pressed on, fueled by their belief in the restoration of balance. Eventually, they reached the heart of the Fire Mountains, where the crystal of elements shimmered amid the molten lava. As Princess Isabella reached out to claim the crystal, flames erupted, blocking her path. Sir William bravely shielded her from the searing heat, allowing her to use her magical abilities. She summoned a water shield that enveloped her and Sir William, and together they retrieved the Crystal of Elements. With the first artifact in their possession, the trio ventured into the Whispering Caverns, a labyrinthine maze known for its deceptive whispers. The second artifact, the Scepter of Illusions, lay hidden within its depths. The caverns whispered malicious lies, tempting the heroes to doubt each other. But their unbreakable bond and Princess Isabella's unwavering resolve shielded them from the tricks of the caverns. As they navigated the twisting tunnels, they encountered illusions that tested their trust and loyalty. Together, they deciphered the true path and reached the heart of the caverns. There, Princess Isabella took the scepter of illusions, ending the confusing whispers and filling her heart with newfound clarity. Her quest led her next to the Enchanted Forest, a mystical realm teeming with ethereal beauty. The third artifact, the Orb of Time, resided in an ancient tree guarded by powerful forest spirits. Princess Isabella and her companions approached the majestic tree, their footsteps reverent as they paid homage to the spirits. The spirits tested their worthiness, challenging them with riddles and tasks that tested their wisdom and empathy. Princess Isabella's kindness and respect for the forest's inhabitants earned her the spirit's trust. With their blessing, she retrieved the Orb of Time, whose luminous glow filled the forest with new life. The final artifact, the Amulet of the Ancients, was said to belong to Malachi himself. Princess Isabella and her companions ventured into the heart of the Shadow Citadel, Malachi's stronghold, where darkness engulfed everything. Guided by the amulet's light, they infiltrated the citadel, navigating its labyrinthine corridors and dodging vicious traps. Finally, they reached the throne room, where Malachi, a formidable figure shrouded in dark magic, awaited them. He unleashed a barrage of dark spells that tested the hero's resolve. Drawing on the power of the artifacts she had recovered, Princess Isabella unleashed a dazzling display of light and magic. The Amulet of the Ancients responded to her pure-hearted intentions, dispelling Malachi's darkness and weakening his powers. With one last burst of power, Princess Isabella banished the sorcerer, returning him to the depths of the shadows from whence he came.
After recovering all four artifacts, Princess Isabella and her companions returned to the Kingdom of Eldoria. The moment she returned each artifact to its rightful place, the kingdom blossomed with newfound harmony. The people rejoiced and celebrated Princess Isabella as their savior. Princess Isabella's bravery and determination had not only saved Eldoria, but inspired others to stand against the darkness and preserve the delicate balance of magic. Her story would be passed down through the generations, a reminder of the power of courage, friendship, and the indomitable spirit of a true hero. And Princess Isabella, now a legendary figure, ruled her kingdom with wisdom, compassion, and a heart forever entwined with the magic of Eldoria.